the Battle of Champor but was the opening engagement of the Six Days Campaign. It was fought on 10 February 1814 by a French force under Napoleon I against Russians and Prussians under Lieutenant General Count Holsefi F. The battle was a French victory. The Battle of Champor but was one of the few times during the War of the Sixth Coalition that France was able to take to the field with her considerable numerical advantage. Prelude. Napoleon moved against an overextended Prussian army in the hope of whittling it down by a series of battles. On 10 February, he caught General Olsafi Ev's Ninth Corps of 5,000 Russians near the village of Bay just south of Champorbert, a town located in the valley of the Marne, east of Paris. Napoleon's French army consisted of 30,000 hungry and tired men, including many raw conscripts, and 120 cannons. However the French, nonetheless, enjoyed a 6 to 1 advantage. They were commanded in the field by the Marshal, Auguste Marmont, under the direction of the Emperor himself. Battle. Olsafi F. Pickets were overrun by ten hundred and although badly outnumbered, Olsafi F. decided to fight rather than retreat. His decision was based on the mistaken hope that he would get reinforcements from Field Marshal Blücher in time to prevent a disaster. He was wrong, and Marmont crushed him. No help was coming and after five hours of fighting, the Russians had been forced to fall back through Champorbert and before they could reach Itoges, some of the corps was enveloped by Marshal Ney's cavalry corps. The French lost 600 killed and wounded out of the 13,300 infantry and 1,700 cavalry that were engaged in the action. The Russians lost 2,400 men and 9 guns out of the 3,700 soldiers and 24 guns that were present. Captured were General Lieutenant Holsefi F and General Major Paul Teretsky, who led a brigade. A brigade under Major General Kornilov fought its way out. Aftermath This victory split Blucher's army in two. The next day Napoleon attacked the vanguard and defeated Austin Sacken and York at Montmorel, before turning and defeating the main body of Blucher's army Battle of Vauchamps on 14 February.